Hi there, I'm Jennifer with Bromefields, and today I'm going to show you the difference between knit stitches and purl stitches and how to knit in the round. So I have some here, some examples I got started. Um, this is mostly used at the beginning and end of most projects because if you start off with just all knit stitches, uh, your project has a tendency to roll up, so any kind of scarf, leg warmers, boot cuffs, uh, cowls, they curl. So, and that goes for sweaters, everything. So this stitch allows it to lay nice and relaxed without being too tight. So these here are some knit stitches. They're the nice little V chevrons, and this these two here, they're purl stitches and they have they have bumps. Now if I flip it inside out, it's a, a knit stitch on the back side and a purl stitch on the front. All right, so let's make a few. So a knit stitch, you start going into the front and I knit a uh, continental style uh, to just easy for me. I've tried holding it many different ways and just wrapping it around my first finger I have found to be the best, work the best for me with the, I don't like to have a lot of tension because I don't want to make really tight stitches. So I make sure that my yarn is loose off of the ball and I just hold it loosely in my, between my two front fingers. So I come through the front, I pick it and I pull it through the loop. Now a purl stitch, I'm going to bring my yarn to the front. So it was in the back. Now I'm going to bring it in the front and I'm going into the front of my stitch. I'm going to wrap it and then push it through and take it off. So I'll do that again. So through the front, wrap it around and push it through and off. Now my yarn goes back to the back and I'm going through the front, pick it in the back and then I push it through. And I do that just so that I have a nice even. I try to do the same thing with every stitch. So let's scoot it around a little bit. So that creates a little bump in the front. So in the front, pick, push through. And then knit a stitch and purl two stitches in the front. Knit two stitches, purl two stitches, bring my yarn into the front, and then I have to readjust my yarn, and I usually push with my, my index finger, and um, some needles are very sharp and not very nice to my index finger. These ones aren't too sharp and I think I've built up a little bit of a callus. But whenever I started knitting, I used a I used a band-aid. And even sometimes whenever I knit a lot, I put a band-aid on my index finger so that it uh, doesn't hurt. So knit two and purl two. And that's it and you just keep going in that pattern that gives you a nice ribbed edge for like the top and bottom of leg warmers and boot cuffs cowls or the edges of blankets so that is a knit stitch and purl stitch and knitting in the round